Uh, yeah, it's, it's, uh, I don't know. I didn't think, uh, you know, waking up yesterday morning and, um, you know, I didn't know what was going to happen and obviously very nervous, but, uh, I'm probably more excited I've ever been. And just the fact that I get to, uh, come back where I started my professional career and, and kind of get my feet back on the ground. And, and not only do I want to just come back there for me personally, but I want to, uh, you know, speak for the city and, uh, everyone involved there and, um, obviously want to, you know, hopefully turn that team into a contender and be a part of it. Can you talk about what, True North has given you, uh, I guess, in your hockey career here? It was kind of a no-brainer, the, the fact that they wanted me there. And, um, um, you know, it was kind of me personally for me and making that decision was probably the, the easiest thing for me just because it, it came down to not just what anything else for me. It just came down to the character that those guys have and, and how much they believe in me and the opportunity that they've given me and how much they've stuck by me and just their loyalty to me. So I just wanted to be loyal back to them. And, um yeah, I don't know. It's just uh, I'm very excited. I'm truly grateful, and and the fact that yesterday I got I got to talk to pretty much everyone. Uh, you know, I talked with the coach and Zinger and uh, Chipper, and um, you know everything. Uh, they all said really good things, and just the fact that they went out of their way and called me, uh, it went a long ways for me. So, you know, Claude said at the end of the year that uh, you know if if he would give you a chance, uh, you know, if he were, if he were put in a position to be an NHL head coach, uh, how big a factor did that play into it, knowing that you have a guy who believed in you uh, at the head at the head coaching position? Yeah, well, I, yeah, I, I talked with him uh, yesterday and, and uh, had a really good conversation with him, and um, everything went, uh, you know, really well. And just like our year-end meeting went really well there too, and um, that play, that had a lot to do with it. It's uh, familiar and. Um, uh, you know, obviously Zinger has a lot to do with it for me, and uh, he's stuck by me through everything, and uh, he's been there for everything. And um, you know, and I, I, you know, I, out of giving giving everything back, the least I can do is uh, you know be the best player that I can be and, and be a part of uh, their organization. And then hopefully that that happens here. And I'm extremely excited, and I just want to help the team uh, any way I can possible. What do you have you had a chance to look at the roster, or what do you like about it going into the year? Uh, I, I just like how there's, you know, there's a lot of, uh, it's going to kind of be like, uh, you know, a lot of, I don't know, I like kind of like younger guys, but uh, obviously a lot of guys that, uh, a lot of, you know, a lot of heart and a few guys there that, um, you know, have obviously been there, won the cup, gone all the way, they know what it takes, but um, I think the team's going to have a lot of energy and, and it's going to be a character team and, and I think everyone's going to kind of feed off everyone and, um, you know, obviously they're not done with, with what they're going to do, but if I could be a part of that and be, um, you know, play the way I think I'm capable of playing, it's it's going to be, uh, you know, I'm extremely excited. And I think the team um, and how the how True North, how Zinger, how, you know, Mark and everyone handles everything that that team is going to be a contender, um, you know, if not this year, right right off the get go here. So it's going to be exciting to be a part of it. And and then the fact it's the Winnipeg Jets again, it's, uh, you know, it's, it's a dream come true for me personally.